What's up guys? Not the winner back again. I wanted to bring you guys another Diablo help video. Uh, a bunch of people have been asking me where to farm gems, and I know I mentioned how you can farm up a lot of gems by farming uh, the um, High Council and Provincial. But, for example, say you have yourself a flawless gem, and we'll make one now. So say I have a flawless amethyst and I'm hunting for perfect gems. You can actually upgrade a single flawless into a perfect by finding a gem shrine. Now we're on nightmare difficulty, so there's the chance of death still. Um, so might not be the smartest thing, but we're just going to start teleporting. And whenever you see one of these, so that's a monster shrine. But you'll see, uh, we'll find like maybe like four or five in the zone. Overall, we'll hit up this on the way. Thank you. Um... And you might not find any uh, gem shrines your first try. It might take you uh, a couple load in. So you might want to check like the dark wood or other zones. Um, because it's not guaranteed to show up. But this one, uh, look, gem shrine. And what do we have here? Stamina. Okay. So um, it's not guaranteed that you're going to get a gem shrine. But Stony Field has one of the higher chances from my understanding. Um, so we have our flawless amethyst. We're going to click on the shrine. We lose that and get a perfect amethyst. That simple. Boom. Just took me, what, a few seconds? We didn't even check the seed or anything by, like, moving around and checking the zone. 100% um, super fast way of getting these amethysts. And even if you don't get a lucky seed like I got um, and you don't get the gem shrine, it might take you two to three resets. It might take you four minutes, maybe five minutes, absolute max. But this allows you to farm for specific gems. So instead of upgrading your three flawless amethyst, if you really need a lot of amethyst and none of the other gems, farming the council, you're going to get all sorts of gems. It's not just going to be, hey, here's only the amethyst that you've been asking for. So one of the best ways is to make sure that you have a large stockpile of the flawless amethyst or even just the normal amethyst if you need some flawless. And instead of upgrading them three for the upgrade, um, you can just sit there and just keep refreshing till you get enough gem shrines and it will only take you a few minutes per run and you'll be able to upgrade all your gems in a much more efficient manner and uh amethysts typically go for a lot more money because like i was showing in another video you can re-roll some pretty sweet necklaces uh with the amethyst um so this is definitely one of the more sought after gems and you can typically trade like people will be like oh i'll trade you two perfect diamonds for an amethyst or two perfect sapphire uh, so you can get extra gems from people for these amethyst. So if you have a bunch of flawless, just go ahead and upgrade them without using the cube. Um, if this was helpful for you guys, please like, subscribe, comment down below. And uh, let me know some of the cooler items that you've been able to trade for with just perfect gems. Um, thank you all for watching and have a great day.